dunk contest. Uh, you know what? I have an apology to make here. I picked Mac McClung to win because I wanted the chaos, right? I just wanted the league to get a little bit embarrassed. But my goodness, he defeats Trey Murphy. Three perfect on the first try dunks. Um, here he is with our own Shams leading up to the contest itself. How many dunks on dunk contest night are we going to see that we've never seen before? There's at least two that I know have never been done in the contest. Um, and hopefully I make them. That's that's the number one goal. But uh, no, uh, at, at least two. He, he's one of those kids that he either looks 16 or 40. I, I just don't know what to do half the time. Uh, but Shams, did he save it? A lot of people are saying he saved the dunk contest. I, you, you hear that every like three, four years, right? Like player <laughs> or X, like Zach Levine saved the dunk contest. I don't know if the dunk contest can ever be saved. I think that it could be back to the level where it's respectable. And obviously, Mac McClung stole the show Saturday night and he told me he had two dunks. And I remember I put that clip out. There was some hate, some positivity. Uh, I think the odds <laughs> also changed. So shout out to the odds. But the, the one thing that I heard in the aftermath is there were like two or three dunks that Mac McClung had, not even the ones that we saw, right? There was a 540 and then there was that double pump over, over the two uh, guys, uh, two friends of his. Um, there were other dunks that he had that he was he, he, he's saving for next year if he's in the dunk contest <laughs> again next year, which he, which he will be unless he's not in the NBA. Or, or in the G League, but um, I mean, the, the, the kid put on a show. He's a, he's he's a good dude, and I think I don't know if he saved it, but he brought it back to really, really high level respectability, in my opinion. Yeah, I mean, what this kid? He was the weekend, and I think everyone made the jokes about him, and he's not an NBA player, and, and I was one of those guys as well, and I still think it's slightly weird that he's not an actual NBA player. And well, this, he is and, now. <laughs> yeah, and, and, technically. Sure. But listen, he great he timing, right? Out. Yeah, he showed out. This dunk right here was really, really mm -hmm. nasty. The the tap on the backboard reverse was really, really nasty. And obviously, the appeal is this is a you know five eleven white kid that looks like my accountant, and he's jumping over. <laughs> That is really impressive. That is fun to watch. He's going against these nine, seven foot NBA players that are extremely athletic and it wasn't even close and he should have got all fifties. Lisa Leslie smoked him on one on a, yeah, on a she did. Time, but he's kidding. <laughs> and, then, and then watching him honestly in the interviews and watching him, how humble he is and how he's enjoyed this journey and process. I'm, I'm super hyped for the kid and this was his moment and, and he took full advantage of it. And, who knows? Maybe I mean I think he still has to be on a team next year, and like to come back. There's a lot of these guys I've seen these dunk contests, the street baller guys that they could fly around. We're not inviting them, so how you know? What I mean, like he's got to be Change. on a rock. Yeah. It's coming, Eddie. Mac McClung has played in two NBA games in his yes, career, counts. so I guess in that sense he's an NBA. <laughs> I, look, watching him talk with Shams, and then watching him talk at the dunk contest, and then watching him introduce. Uh, Post Malone, he's such a <laughs> humble guy, and just like really enjoying being there, I, it, it became really hard to hate him. I do kind of hate the he brought the dunk contest back stuff. Uh, I I didn't. They kept saying a star is born, guys. He is he's not a star. He he's, he had a great dunk contest and he did really well. If we're calling him a star, we're stretching it a little bit. I had a friend of mine tell me. Uh, this is peak white privilege because he did a 360 and they called it a 540. <laughs> and I was like, that's that's what it's about, I guess, right there. Great performance by him and Trey Murphy. I'm disappointed by by Kmart Jr. Uh, but hey, it, it was a good dunk contest. It was a it was a awesome. solid NBA Saturday night. Did it come Steph back? Show. Like it, <laughs> former teammate Steph Curry, by the way. Like just a little bit of slant from his guy, I'm guessing. But it was cool. It was cool. I don't it think he's a star. Good. He got a Puma contract, and so congrats on the Puma contract, and I think that's dope. He it's won. a great story now. I want to see him in an NBA game dunk it. He's never dunked in an NBA game, so I'm holding the trophy. If he had dunked an NBA game. He's dunked an NBA game before. He's definitely dunked an NBA game before. He's he has? I want to see the footage. Uh, Lakers, I need to see the Lakers. footage, he, too. He, 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 he did a double pump Lakers. Though. That was but Summer League. No, I think it was an NBA game. The craziest thing, the cra <laughs> no, we can, we gotta pull up the footage. The craziest thing we got back it. to the dunk contest that I noticed being there was he made it his like he made all his dunks on the first attempt. Hey, like usually yeah, you I see did. guys yeah. take two attempts, 
three attempts. Kenyon Martin, he, Kenyon Martin, actually, I think might have had the sickest dunk on that. I think Mac McClung had a nice dunk. I think Kenyon Martin's first dunk, up and under, um, uh, windmill, like that was nasty. He, it just took him three tries. Yeah. Uh, but what Mac did, making it on his first attempt every single time, I thought that was very impressive too. Yeah. I'm with you, Shams. Like I'm a purist on the dunk. Like if you t- you can get one mess up once, and I'm like, all right, fine. But you lose me. You, it just I feel like it's like, right. and I know they get three attempts now, and they get the the minute twenty, whatever the heck it is. But you got to get it on the first try. That's what Shaq kept telling everybody. Take, oh, we got the dunk. Oh, eat it, Eddie. Wow. Eat it. Eat wow. it. Wow. <laughs> Jokic should have fouled him. Jokic should have fouled him. This was preseason for sure. Shut up. Preseason. No, it's not. Yo, this Yo, kid this is, is a star. one of those. This is what. This is one of those. The yeah, game there is you over. Go. Why are you doing there you it? Go. And hey, then he's, he's dunked an NBA game. We pulled up the tapes. So that why is he not nasty, on a roster though. for real? Like, why is he not on a roster on the reg? Like, why? What's the problem here? Because this is fun. Back's there enough, run it back. But there are oh, enough bad teams, Because he's shorter than right? Shams. Well, he is yeah, shorter I, than all of us, Michelle, actually. But. I got homies in Orlando that can do crazy dunks. It doesn't mean they can do anything else in, a, in an NBA game. I know, but I feel like he's going to put butts in seats, like, you know, give everybody these illusions of grandeur. I don't know. I, I don't know. Back but, only on running back. Eddie, like, Eddie, Eddie, Eddie. Eddie, you, you, you owe him an apology. Eddie, real quick. Eddie was hanging out. Back check with Shams. Back Shams. If you buy a ticket to the Sixers game to see Mac McClung maybe play four hey. minutes, you no. you have issues. You have okay, issues. but that's the Sixers. The Sixers are in contention. I'm talking like all the teams that are not in contention. Like the Hornets, the Spurs. Like Put the them Spurs. on the Spurs. Rockies. Shut up, Eddie. Make a call. I wasn't going to say that. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. Look, I think I think he should be invited back, no matter where he is in life this time next year. Just like on a legacy invite. Like, it's almost no. like you're the reigning champ. You have to come back. Why not? You got to defend Michelle, your, if, your title. If, if he's working yeah. at Geico, he should not be in the NBA <laughs> dunk contest. No. I'm sorry. You know what? You no. know what, though? I, I'm, sure. I'm pretty sure he'll be there next year. I mean, this is a guy. He turned down like $1.2 million to play in China just so he could try to be in the NBA this year. See? And, he, and he ends up in the dunk contest. He ends up on a two-way. I don't see how Philly can cut him anytime soon. I assume he'll ride out the rest of the season. Uh, on that two way, and then you go from there. But I, I, I'm pretty sure we'll see him next year in the dunk contest. Yeah, because uh, who was it? Ja already said he's not going to do it. Zion said he'll consider it. Like, I don't know what else you guys, nobody's coming. There's no white knight coming in way, that's going to save the day. Hey, you noticed Ja had his own little dunk contest in the game, though. He wanted to give us the outtakes of what he could show us. But that's that's garbage, is it not? Like, you've specifically said you don't want to do the dunk contest, but yet. Yeah. Tease us all with what you could. I it don't should be get all, it. It should have been all layups for him in the game if he's not going <laughs> to do the contest. <laughs> Just crappy threes. Finger like, rolls, yeah. Finger rolls. Uh, yeah, it's fair. Uh, God, I, I actually, I had more fun watching over the weekend than I thought I would. Um, I just want to throw that out there. I'm usually pretty negative.